uh, hi everyone here we are talking about another metric which can be used for faster calculation um, uh, let's talk about the number uh, which ends with 5 so suppose if we have to take a square how we can do that in our mind without using a calculator so suppose if I have 35 and I want to square, square it then in that case what I have to do is write 25 in the end and then take 3 which is the first digit and multiply it with its increment so 3 plus 1 is 4 and 4 into 3 is 12 so the answer is 1 2 2 5 so another example if I have uh, 65 uh, square in that case I have to write 25 and then uh, I'll take 6 so multiply 6 by 6 plus 1 that will be equal to 7 7 into 6 is 42 so the answer is 4225 so how uh, this trick works so let's uh, uh, look into that so suppose uh, we have uh, any number uh, which ends with 5 so that number can be written as uh, 10 into x plus 5 so here suppose if x is equal to uh, 3 then this number will be equal to 35 right so suppose if we have 10 x plus 5 and we want to do a square of it if we do a square of it that will be equal to uh, 100 uh, x square plus 100 x plus 25 so if we solve this that will be equal to 100 into x into x plus 1 plus 25 so as you can see that uh, um, we are uh, taking the first digit and we adding a number into it multiplying it uh, multiplying it by 100 and then adding a 25 so here if we have uh, x is equal to 3 so if uh, x is equal to 3 then we'll get uh, 3 into 4 uh, into 100 uh, plus 25 so that will give me again 1200 plus 25 so we'll get uh, 1 2 2 5 so this is how this trick works so basically uh, we are uh, adding the first digit by 1 multiplying it with the first digit putting at the 100 uh, multiplying by 100 and then adding 25 in the end so another example if I have uh, uh, 85 square and I want to multiply uh, I want to do a square so that will be equal to 25 and uh, we'll do 8 into 9 that's equal to 72 so answer is 7225 so this is how this trick works uh, I hope this helps I'll see you in the next trick thanks Uh, hi everyone in this video we'll talk about another math trick which can be used for faster calculation uh, today we'll talk about how to square any three digit number without using a calculator so let me begin with the example so suppose if i have 206 and i want to square this number so how will i do that so in that case first i look at the first digit and uh, i will take a square of digit so the square of 2 is 4 so 2 square is 4 uh, then I'll take the last digit and I'll take a square of that digit so square of 6 is 36 right and now to get the middle numbers what I'll do is I'll multiply 2 and 6 this 2 and 6 and then I'll multiply again with 2 and that will be uh, 6 into 4 24 so that will be the answer uh, let me take uh, another example so uh, suppose if I have um, 409 and I want to do a square in that case um, 4 square is equal to 16 9 square 
is equal to 81 and 4 into 9 into 2. So 9 uh, into 8 that is uh, 72. So my answer is 167281. So that's our answer. Now, uh, if we have something which is uh, more uh, uh, bigger, or in, I will give you example of a carryover. So now, suppose if I have eight twenty-five, and I want to do a square of this number, so this will be a little different. So here, the approach will be same. So eight square. So eight square is sixty-four, and then twenty-five square. So twenty-five square is 625 right so we'll write 25 and then we have to write a 6 here because we can only use the two digits in the end now if we multiply 8 25 and 2 that will be 400 so we can only write two zeros here and I have to write a 4 here why because we can only take the two digits so now if we uh, add them together then it will be 6 and 4 plus 4 is 8 0 6 plus 0 is 6 and 25 so that will be my answer so if you practice uh, then you can always do this calculation without even writing it on the paper now how this trick works so let's look into it so any three digit number can be written as in the following form uh, 100 x plus y uh, so if x is equal to 3 and y is equal to 6 then it will be 300 and 6 right now if I need to square this number so in that case it will be equal to 10,000 x square plus 200 xy plus y square now you can see that we have four zeros for x square two zeros for 2xy and no zeros for y square so if we add them together so it will look something like that x square 0 0 0 0 right and then we have 2xy 0 0 so this 2xy will go on to the uh, next two digits here right and then we have y square which will go here so because there is a zero here so the y square can occupy this two digits in the end so again if i have x is equal to 9 and uh, y is equal to uh, 11 then you can see that uh, 9 square is 81 so there is no limit for x square here right uh, and then uh, we have uh, uh, 2xy so 2 into 9 into 11 so that will be equal to 18 into 11 and that will be equal to 198 so we'll have 1 98 and then we have y square so 11 square is 121 so 21 and 1 here right so in that case the answer would be equal to 8 9 9 9 21 so that's your answer so i hope this uh, video helps and i'll see you in the next metric thank you Uh, hi everyone in this uh, video we'll talk about some quick matrix which can be used for faster calculation uh, without using a calculator so first we will start uh, with the number which are uh, close to 50 and if you want to take a square of that numbers so for example if we have 48 square so how will we calculate this uh, number so if you look at 48 uh, it is close to 50 so it is uh, 50 minus 2 square 
right so in this case what we'll do is we'll subtract 2 from 25 and then we'll do 2 square so the answer will be equal to 2304 uh, another way uh, let another example is like 46 square in this case we'll subtract 4 from 25 and do 4 square so the answer will be equal to 2104 oh 2116 let's take another example if i have 53 square then in this case it will be 25 plus 3 and then 3 square so the answer will be equal to 2809 uh, how this trick works so let's uh, look on the left side so if we have uh, something close to 50 it can be written as 50 plus x square and uh, 50 plus x square can be written as 2500 plus 100x plus x square or that will be equal to 25 plus x into 100 plus x square so uh, now as you can see that if x is equal to uh, 3 then uh, what i'm doing is i'm adding 25 plus 3 right and uh, then i am adding 3 square so the answer is equal to 2809 so this is how this trick works it's based on uh, a plus b whole square uh, I hope this trick helps. I'll see you in the next trick. Thanks.